Now, hello there. This quick tip is for people who um, likes to drink blood. So, it's October. It's easy to get blood or artificial blood. Let's, let's be honest here. Let's be real. Artificial blood everywhere. Uh, it's really easy to get chopped up limbs. So, uh, if that's something you need in your life. Like if you're playing like a zombie or a vampire, werewolf, anything like that, a monster character, monster character, these things are good to have. Already said that. But if you want to go out and grab some artificial blood and you want to drink that, a lot of it doesn't really taste that well unless you go out and buy the maybe the really expensive stuff and then it doesn't really taste that well anyway. So you can make your own or you can buy some. But here's the quick tip. If you are one of the people who need to put artificial blood in your mouth, first of all, make sure it's something that you can actually eat or drink. Um, this is, this is something I made myself and it's rather thick actually. Yeah, I think you can. <laughs> but the advice is to put mint in. It might not create a good flavor, but at least they're creating a fresh flavor. So if you do have to drink blood, I might as well just get a fresh breath, breath out of it instead of getting that really weird artificial... Um, what, what do they usually put in? Strawberry or uh, cherry taste or something like that? I recommend using some kind of mint crystals or chopped up, uh, what are called the uh, mentors or something, and just mix it in there with it. It's, ba it you, it's better if you make it yourself. If you go out and buy it, it's, I don't think you should add anything to that. But if you make the blood yourself, add some mint to it. It's a lot easier to get down and it's a lot nicer for the people that you actually have to go around and fight or, well, not fight, but uh, what are called chase or eat or something like that and also just talk with. I mean, if you forget to brush your teeth, just drink some blood. Oh my God. Still doesn't taste super good. It's more like the consistency of it. But the flavor is not that bad. It's just the consistency. It's so, it's so thick. Oh. Ugh. Anyway, if you have any quick tips, tips and tricks, especially something monster or Halloween themed for this month, because it's October and Halloween is in the end of the month, be sure to leave them down in the comment section below and write quick tip in front of it. That way I can easily grab your quick tip and pin it up here in a video for other LARPers to see. Remember to subscribe if you want to support the channel. And also tell me if you want to get this recipe for blood. I don't know if I've written it down somewhere. I think it's actually one of you guys who gave it to me. Well, maybe not this recipe, but at least one recipe. There's a ton of it online, which is one of the reasons I've not done it before. But this has mint in it and you can drink it. It's not super good, but yeah. I'm getting off track here. Subscribe if you want to support the channel. Hit the notification bell if you want to be part of the notification squad. And uh, yeah, you can also jump over to Instagram and see what we've been doing, working on, LARP we're going to, etc., etc. Other than that, see you LARPers later. Bye. Yes. I think if it weren't that thick, it would actually be rather decent. It might be because there's way too much cornstarch in this thing. You can hit the video on your left if you want to see more lap watch videos or if you want to subscribe and support the channel you can hit the channel subscribe uh, well the channel icon on your right